Are you sure there's any pumpkin nests around here? Like, we gotta fill this episode by the end of the week. I can just go to the store and buy some pumpkins. See one. Remember kids, if you're gonna steal a pumpkin egg from a pumpkin nest, make sure the mothers aren't around. They're very territorial. It looks like we're okay. Let's just get in quick. Hey guys, I'm out of the Destructoid office on my contractually obligated three week Halloween holiday, but tis the season and we wanted to bring you a spooky Halloween episode of All the Cartridge brought to you by Call of Duty Ghosts. So let's kill some pumpkins. So every year in America we buy and carve up tons and tons of pumpkins, at least 50, probably more, but tragically they're kind of just left to rot, and we don't do anything with them. So, as you're making your jack-o'-lanterns this year, save the seeds, and where you can also cook the sweet, savory pumpkin flesh into some delicious pumpkin bread. So, we are going to peel out all these juicy, delicious innards. And of course, uh, since Call of Duty Ghosts is sort of kicking off the next generation of consoles, as well as last generation, we're also going to add a little kick to our pumpkin seeds, grind up some peppers, and season them as well. So, we washed our pumpkin seeds a little bit, uh, and we're going to dress them very simply. We're going to add our subscribed salt. Not too much, you want to be subtle about it and a little bit of olive oil. Just give those a good mix. Spread them out on a pan. Have an oven preheating at about 300 degrees. They're gonna go in the oven for 30 minutes. And for that last added kick, we're gonna add up our ground pepper. So, I know everyone's gonna run out in a march of impressive consumerism and pick up the new Call of Duty game when it drops. And that's why we wanted to do sort of the opposite, because Halloween is a, you know, a bit of a consumerist holiday as well. You go out and buy your costume and your pumpkin, and you just let it rot away. So we wanted to really, really honor the pumpkin and use every part of it. And that's why we're gonna butcher the shit out of it. So, we're gonna cut our pumpkin, halves, quarters, whatever works for you, and we're gonna throw it in the oven for about an hour until the flesh gets nice and supple and squishy, and that's gonna get pureed and put into our pumpkin bread. Okay, about 30 minutes in the oven. And our pumpkin seeds should be ready. Our pumpkin flesh pumpkins themselves are still gonna be uh, cooking for a little longer. Get them nice and tender so we can puree that up and put it into our pumpkin bread. When your pumpkins are nice and fleshy and tender, scoop them out. Throw them in a blender, we're gonna puree them up and that's gonna go into our uh, bread mix. Okay, we got our pumpkin puree. Let's put it all together. Four eggs, boom. A cup of olive oil. Two thirds cup of water. Two teaspoons, baking soda, some cinnamon, some salt. Start mixing her up. 
Bacon, let's go with the pumpkin puree. Okay, hip hip puree. Some sugar. Oh God, that was a lot of sugar. And it's gonna be a lot of flour. This bowl might not be big enough, but it's all I could find. Steady as she ghosts. Call of Duty. Batter up. It's topical because the World Series is going on. Let's pour this into our cooking covens. Put our bread in the oven, 45 minutes. Let's check on them, 350 degrees. The pumpkin bread is just about ready. Two dominoes of pumpkin seeds. All the way. And I guess go see who just rang the doorbell. Tell me if you hear the timer. Shouldn't have disturbed the nest. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Keller. I'm just so sorry. 